The goal in the School of Fine Arts is to help all students reach their fullest potential as practising artists. Undergraduate and postgraduate fine arts programs work towards the creation of a body of work that takes on board theory, practice and application. What I actually liked about CAFA and the program and what I was offered was like it was really like practical. It was actually put your hands in the clay or carve wood and actually make something. Of course there's the balance between concept and process and uh, there's, there's always the criticism that there's there's a focus sometimes too much on process in the, in the production of work, and particularly a process-focused medium like, like printmaking. But it also allows for mulling and allows for possibility and allows for potential. And, and what we try and do here at COPA is offer and demand of our students that they make choices. Choices conceptually, and technically, and it's those choices that are going to be the lifeblood for their future as, as working artists. There are facilities for so many different types of, of printmaking here, and um, generally students sort of pick their own little one that's their favourite, but uh, at the beginning when you start off in printmaking, you try out lots of different types, which is like fantastic to have them all in one in one space, in one time. Initially I was more of a two-dimensional artist, I guess I've always just worked, I guess it was more, a lot easier to, to work with. You don't need as much space when you're painting or, or drawing. It's just stuff I've done on the floor or um, around. But when I, when I came to Kofa, I got exposed to a lot of different disciplines. I guess I chose sculpture because I hadn't really done it before. And I've actually found myself much preferring sculpture. I came from a drawing background. I did a lot of drawing, and so what I um, ended up specialising in is dry point, which is very similar to, to like drawing with um, with a pen, for example. When I when I came here and we first had a few little projects in different fields, and I discovered this this medium, and I was really drawn to it because um, because of that background that I'd had. I probably owe everything that I do to this place because. Um, I came to Kofa as a, an art student that was doing art education, so I got trained to be a high school teacher. And then what happened was I fell in love with painting at the end of my four years of training and then came back and did what was then on as grad diploma and then came back and did an MFA. So me becoming an artist was falling in love with painting at the college and just pursuing it, just painting, doing as many things as I could to do with painting. A painter doesn't have to be a painter. A painter can work in installation. We've recently renamed Sculpture and called it Sculpture Performance and Installation to recognise the full breadth of practice and how it crosses over into time-based art, it crosses over into uh, video, um, performance, sound, electronics, into all sorts of other areas. Through the disciplines of painting, drawing, sculpture, performance, installation, textiles and ceramics, students facilitate the establishment of their careers as practising artists. We see this semi-vocational, hopefully where all the students are looking at uh, contemporary visual arts practice uh, in all of its mutations and forms. Uh, it doesn't necessarily mean that they're all going to exhibit uh, their work, but it does mean that they participate in the culture industry or the arts and entertainment industry. COFA prepared me for uh, also communicating with the outside world, you know, uh, dealing with those professional issues or professional situations where I had to talk to galleries, curators and um, develop a relationship with them. Many graduates of the Bachelor of Fine Arts, Master of Art and PhD programs have achieved national recognition and have won the prestigious Blake and Archibald Prizes the Helen Limpria Travelling Art Scholarship, the Sam Stagg Award and Fulbright and Rotary Scholarships. You can come here as wanting to do one thing and then come out at the other end doing something else. So you can actually find who you are in the college, you know, and I think the best teachers here do that. I think I've learned so much how to be independent, how to be confident, or how to really live for myself.